Good day, fellas. Here is Kirezul with uh, some tournament battles. I want to show you on the subscribers' requests to show a few battles. Re the reality is that in this tournament, this medal I got for free. I had no battles that were close or even interesting. They were all very easy, easy opponents. I don't know. The online didn't go into games when we played. Um, so basically it was a free medal, but still, if you're interested to see in some tactics I used, uh, I'm gonna show you a few. Uh, this was the longest match I had, 19 minutes, against a guy that is not with a strong account, but has a very decent gameplay. So. This was the only match that I felt that I'm playing. The rest was just a walkover. Because the um, the opponents I got were just too easy. No, no, there wasn't a fair uh, matchmaking in this tournament for me. So in this game I went... Uh, uh, this is how you scout here. You go through this cliff. So he's going, uh, I decided to test how strong his building is. So I see it's very strong even though it's building and has no armor, it doesn't do much damage. So I get an idea of what kind of opponent I'm getting, how good his upgrades are. We go straight to Salaris and we upgrade to Thor's. He tried to scout, he died. I got the Salaris. Oh, he starts to harass my line. So not to lose HP on the Thors, I send them to bomb this line. It's better to lose them by bombing than just to lose them for nothing, so... I, I never go two vehicle factories, but in this game I went because I saw Solaris. And uh, yeah, another one, they were recharging, I didn't have fuel, only for three of them. And I bombed close to the base. But I'm putting pressure with my survivors. So. Another one coming. But I got no fuel. So, as soon as I got some fuel, I'm attacking him as well. Losing my shield. Didn't lose it. And yeah. Giving him the same response. Let's see if he manages to build in time. I lost no force. I was constantly healing them and making their fields in time. 
bombing somewhere so they buy time for me to rebuild the airfields. But I, I think he lost all of them. Taking out AAs. No more zeros for you. Oh, look what he did. On vehicle scouting, he came in with the Solaris to take out my force. That was a good move from him. I sent my Solaris to chase him and attack with the force. Those who have fuel. And attack with Zeus. Now all my airfields are down, but as you can see, the boost I used for construction. And those who won't die will return. They're coming back. So, and my Solaris killed his Solaris because I had the shield. When he was attacking buildings, I was attacking him. So I lost no swords again. But I could feel he, he has a much weaker account than me. So, not showing. This battle was uh, an interesting match, it's just uh, this was really the, the only opponent that tried to do something. Yeah, and now he gives up. Another tactic, really weak opponent, but after I realize weak opponent after my first scout, I go different tactic. How do I know he's weak? Well, I gave, I took all the resources. Zero to two. So I went straight to HQ5, I think. Yeah, straight HQ5. One vertex for scouting. And I see he's upgrading better, so it's clear to me that this guy, no Avia, no nothing. HQ3 still, HQ3 here. So, uh, yeah, the answer to this, Space Strike. Fastest way to end the game. Cheapest way. I'm making um, making this guy because I needed the contract for uh, for tournament tickets. So I'm just making a hero to kill his. Uh, yeah, I see he's gathering here. My space strike was ready at eight minutes mark. If I used it, there will be no base for him. So I'm just uh, not using it yet because gold defense boost before minute 10 with maxed space strike would just simply demolish the entire base. So my weak, <laughs> my weak Cerberus is trying to do my contract, but it dies quickly, so I didn't make my contract yet. So the only upgraded hero I have is Solaris. going to make the contract and then kill him. That's it, contract done. And now we space strike.
follow up with vertex. Game over. And the last uh, tactic, I mean it's not anything different and the only other guy that uh, put up a decent, tried to put up a decent fight, I could see that he knows what to do but the rank difference, probably account much stronger for me so again no, no match. Still got most of the resources. Going HQ5 with HQ4 to Avia, Hero. He scouted earlier than me, but that's because he didn't put uh, so many factories as me. I see he has many vertex. He won't do Thors. So what I need now is typhoons. As soon as I got at least four or five typhoons, I can move out. And a shield, of course. Second area and hero factory. So mm -hmm. <laughs> We don't want to, him to get a hero. So we bomb it straight away. Controls his vertex pretty well. Taking out my typhoons. Solaris to focus the shield first and then Zeus will just die. The only thing he can do is mass vertex, so I just need to focus on many many titans. And shield. Good reaction from him. But at this point, I don't care if he kills my Thors because I'm gonna finish him with my Solaris. I don't care how many Thors I'm losing. If I didn't have Solaris, I wouldn't bomb this carelessly. I would go with a mix of uh, Vertex and Thor's. Uh, but now I take out his headquarters. And he gives up. So this is what all my games look like, it was all based on the first scout, what is the enemy doing and then adjusting my build accordingly, either go vertex or Thor's, Solaris I always got, and uh, yeah, maybe space strike if the opponent is too weak. Hope you enjoyed this guys, hope it helps you, 6 days left for you to finish it, good luck and uh, yeah, please subscribe, leave a like, cheers guys.